thank you for having me and let, allowing me to pitch my video game idea. My name's Mary, and what I like to... Nick told me I could come up with any video game that I would want to ever make for me. Um, and so this is very specifically for me, and maybe like 10 other girls that own Oculus Rifts are also into vintage clothing. <laughs> Yeah, okay, that's you! Uh, okay, good. Okay, you're gonna, love, you're gonna love this idea. Okay, so it's not just for me. Okay, anyway, moving on. So basically, how I spend my time is like on weekends, I like to go to the Alameda Antique Fair, I like to go to antique stores, you know, thrift stores. I like to, when I'm not, when I don't have time off, when I'm trying to fall asleep, and I'm, I, I get carpal tunnel scrolling eBay on my smartphone. Um, <laughs> You know, Etsy. So this is for me, this is for a game where, like, I could go to a thrift store whenever I feel like it and go shopping uh, and not have to actually spend real money. All right. So this is, the game starts out with location. So, sorry. Uh, you can, um, some, a, a location could be the an estate sale. Uh, thrift store. Today we're gonna go to the vintage shop. <laughs> oh, I, can I turn that off right now? Yeah. How do I do that? Okay. All right. Hear me. Now, when you're on, you have the Oculus Rift on, right? You have the headset on. Um, you are your own avatar, okay? And you're in this world. And when I say points, what I mean is coins, all right? Because it's basically money. Okay, this is me. This is me at the fabulous vintage store. Um, basically, you get points for, like, supermarket sweep status, like if you can find everything really quickly. Um, you get points, like, it, it, like trivia might pop up. They're gonna, you, you pull out a dress, and they're going to be like, is this from the 60s or, like, you know, the 20s? And you have to be like, no, it's freaking 60s, and then you get points. Um, um, you get points, like, um, if, you, if you get, if you, like, for instance, like, say, say you find a, um, like an 80s dress, right? They're like, look at that 80s dress. No, no, wait, it's miscategorized. It's a 1930s Scaparelli gown, Whoa. museum quality, and it, it's only five bucks. So you get you get gold points for that, serious <laughs> points. Um, you get points if you get the good steals before other vendors and they like prep, jack up the price like triple fold. Um, you get points like say you get points by by uh, getting stuff before this bitch. <laughs> shopping too and sometimes they're cool but then sometimes um like this lady she she looked over at you and was like excuse me can i give you a suggestion <laughs> <laughs> handle the clothing at the top of the hanger not from the clothes okay and you just you just hate this bitch <laughs> mind your own freaking business and if you like you can get points from like yelling a really mean contort, you know, to back to her. Like, you could just yell shit to her, but, but really make her feel bad. Um, so you get points for that. Um, um, there's violence in this game, too, because I think girls also, like, I have always wanted to get in a cat fight, uh, and I never have. So this is a good um, expression of that. Um, you can totally kick her ass if you want to. You can pull her hair. Um... Uh, and you can murder. <laughs> um, but here's the thing: so you could get, you could get, you could either like totally win the game by like killing her, um, <laughs> but you can lose the game if you kill her too. So if if yes, wait, no bodily fluids. Okay, on the clothes. <laughs> Can't be any blood. If you if there any blood vomit on anything, you're done. That's it. It's game over. 
But if you have no pressure points, um, you know, if you know like how to choke hold her, um, you win. You win it. You know. Wow. You win it. Um, and then okay, and then so, then okay, so you get all your clothes, and then okay, so so basically that's the end of the game, right? You killed her with pressure points, <laughs> <laughs> and then. Um, the prize for winning is like a million dollars, of course. Um, you get to wear the best garment that you had, and you get to go to this like fantasy, this like real fantasy, um, where you can like, for instance, one of them's gonna be like, you get to go to your favorite era, and just like hang out with your favorite people. So you could go to like the 1930s, you know, Oscars after party, hang out with Claudette Colbert. Um, um, you could go, and then and then also another one is like you get to meet your favorite style icon, and they know you already, and you're they're like you're like you're like best friends. <laughs> And like Elsa Scaparelli is like giving you advice about how to deal with assholes, and and it's just the best. And you can like drink with Elizabeth Taylor, and um, and that's it, guys. That's my game. Great, Mary. That was great. <laughs> Can I ask you a couple questions? Oh, wait. Uh, there's a question and answer period. Oh, here, here. No, for the audience. Oh, the audience. Please. Anybody have any questions for Mary? Yeah. For this game, oh, this Oculus Rift game? What would be your favorite era? Oh, mine would, um, like I said, actually, I, I probably the 30s. <laughs> Hollywood 30s. Um, but, but, you know, one of them, too, it could be like uh, being in a speakeasy in the 20s and with the flappers, and so... That would also be one of my favorites. Yes. You. Um, would it be possible to get extra points if you use some of the clothes to strangle her, but then didn't get any body fluids on the clothes? That would, yeah, you'd like, the, yes. Definitely. <laughs> like, you would get, you'd be able to, like, go to two fantasies after that, maybe. <laughs> yeah. Jeremy. Uh, Mary, as a dude with a specific brand of style, will there be a male version of this game that only comes out in Japan? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> totally. No, there's definitely male versions. Um, there could be a Japanese, like, uh, Harajuku, like, um, style of version. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Any other yeah. questions? I'm trying to see, make sure I, I got everything. But I think that's basically it. Yeah. Mary. Yeah. So can you, like, look in a mirror? And, like, can you, like, adjust what you look like? Or do you, are you you? Oh, you're your own, like, you're your own, you're, you can make your avatar whatever you want. Okay. I want to be myself. <laughs> um, the, also, the cool, not to, like, bring brands into it, but there could be an element where it is actually real shopping. So, you know, the Oculus Rift, you can put input your measurements, you know, and you could know exactly, like, maybe not the real game, but, like, a side thing could be, like, you could actually go and try on clothes. So and use life. real money from the game, right? That's like an o okay. Now can you so can you like can see other players online and then like? Oh, that's you know a good mean? element. And then yeah. like, you can be like, I like the way that looks on you or whatever. Mm. Yeah. Oh, I thought the or other people in the game like, could actually be part of the shoppers and you can kill each other. Right. And, right. Yeah. <laughs> so many yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah okay. Is that all? Yeah. Any more questions? Yeah. All right, thank you very much. Merry Benoit, everybody.